The country of Myanmar is currently being torn apart. It's been three and a half years since a military coup left a power vacuum. And while the military still controls many key areas of the country, dozens of armed ethnic tribes have risen up and taken arms. Not only are they fighting the military, they're also fighting each other. Young people are being drafted into the military against their will and find themselves facing their friends and family who are part of the resistance. Hundreds of thousands of families are caught in the crossfire. And now, over two million people who have been internally displaced find themselves in a place of desperation. Food, supplies, and medicine are becoming difficult to get. Yet the church continues to serve people and share Jesus in Myanmar. Local church pastors are taking in families and children who have nowhere else to go. One pastor recently reported 10 families hiding in his church, taking refuge from the fighting. Another pastor fled the area and has taken in seven Buddhist families. Four of those families have decided to now follow Jesus. Now, dozens of pastors who've been faithfully using our discipleship curriculum have been presented with a new challenge, or shall we say opportunity. They are now mobilizing the church to take relief back to war-torn families, providing the food and supplies they need, and sharing the message of Jesus with a population that is 89% Buddhist. You can help reach thousands this fall in Myanmar. In their darkest hour, you can empower the church to be a place of relief, refuge, and hope. <laughs>